Hello, welcome back. And we're exploring the desert today because we gotta find, we're on a quest, a venture to find, you heard it, the fourth and final great fairy fountain. So I can upgrade all my clothes. So I can get my master sword and what well, what this happened? What what are you doing to me? Do I not have a shield equipped? Ugh. Okay, so you need a shield to ride these guys, but we're I kind of know where we're going, so we're just gonna skip to my loot. Um so basically, we're going to find a big old bag of bones out here in the desert. So these clouded areas won't even show up on your mini-map or your regular map until you explore them. So, and there's an enemy encampment, but we're not, you know. Okay. So since you're on a... a I think this, these guys are called sand seals. That's why they make that lame joke, let's seal the deal, ha 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 ha. But you can't walk over here without uh, your sand, sand seal. Oh willy nilly, that's why it's all graded out. So we're just gonna explore this area real quick. Finding stuff we didn't even know was here. Um, so the way it works, you have to find a particular place in order for it to show up on your map. Okay, do not abandon. Hey, where are you going? No, no, no. Hey, okay, good. I thought he was trying to abandon me. Black man, I still got that hot pocket you wanted, and this is the great fair found. So, this sh shrine is blocked off. You'll see. Um, there's this gonna be this. Well, am I at the wrong shine shrine? I might be thinking about a different shrine. Huh? Well, we're doing some shrine hunting. I thought this was, she's supposed to be like hunched over the shrine. Huh. Or is that the other one I'm thinking about? Yeah, I don't know if I've done this one. Well, anyways, we're both going to be surprised today. Is this like a test or something? Looks like one of those stupid puzzles I'm not interested in. A deadly puzzle. Hmm. I think I've done this one before. Ooh, excuse me. Okay. Alright. And then we got this here. And. Okay, so I already know what I gotta do. So, let's catch this bad boy. Yeah, okay. I see what I gotta do. There we go. So you kind of wanted to just stop a midair. And that's pretty much all there is to it. And then you want to get them onto this nearby, these little electric coil reader thingies and Bob's your uncle. 
not very hard quest and you get a nice little sword ski and that's all she wrote that's that was the whole dungeon yeah so this magical thing is makes everything lit <laughs> All right, and booyah! I'm done with that shrine. Good. I'm one more heart piece to my master sword, which ultimately that's what I'm trying to get to. It's my master sword, so I can finally beat Ganon. You can beat Ganon without your master sword. In fact, I can go right down to the castle and rip him a new one, but I'd rather not. Not without the 13 art and the master sword because it just won't feel right going out there with a master sword you know a willy-nilly and there's some armor i'm trying to upgrade because but i do have all the uh, guardians or whatever all the little zappy zappy powers um okay so um, i kind of complex because i don't know okay yeah i think it's there's another one over here. That might be it. But I thought that would be it. So, again, it's been a long while since I beat this game. There's a lot of dinosaur bones over here. So, I'm guessing I'm the right place. Let me change my outfit real quick. Trying to get him zapped. Bye, Felicia. And your homies coming to join? Ah, Felicia. My house. Don't you forget it. My house. And I'm representing Malibu. Yes, my hair is messed up. And you heard me right. I am representing Malibu because this is your boy. B Rad G. Anyways, yeah, you heard me. <laughs> Seriously, B Rad G. Malibu Tay. <laughs> Please like and subscribe if you get that that uh, if you get that uh, reference. If you get that reference, please like, comment, and subscribe. Waka waka. You can actually collect these swords. Fun fact. They're like rusted travelers claymore or travelers claymore. So, but you know, because you don't really need them to show the way. Okay, you know what? Let me travel on back because I, I do know where I'm going right now. So let me. I've done figured out. You gotta go here. What are you doing? 
Thank you. Come again. So yeah, let's let's do this again. And then I got put on woman clothing for a hundred time. Oh, good in the neighborhood. So in the last episode, we built beat a Malduga. So yeah. So random question of the day for you guys. Do you like egg rolls or spring rolls? Because the other day I was at the Chinese restaurant and they're like, uh, you want the uh, spring roll or the egg roll? And I'm like, well, I know the differences, but you know, what do you have in there? It's like, uh, one we got pork. The other one shrimp, so ordered some egg rolls. Anyways, I like the one with the shrimp. So, so I want to know what y'all think. And all right, lady, rent me up, momento, San Seal. What? No, I didn't. Uh, uh, okay, yeah, let's seal the deal on that sand sale. Yeah, you'll notice these all lead different directions. This leads back to the bazaar, but we don't want to go to the bazaar. We want to go to this other puffy, smoky cloud area. And I do believe you got to do another quest, which you should be able to see in this episode. The quest you had to do, it's kind of ridiculous. You got to go carry this ice block in the, in the shade, and it's kind of ridiculous. But yeah, I do believe this is the right way. Although I'm not going the way I set up on my map, which if I don't find this great fairy found, because I, I don't remember how much gold or rupees in this case you need to free her or whatever. Um, I do it some absorbent amount, some astronomical amount, which um, I have to do some rupee grinding. I may do another montage, I'm not sure, but... Well, okay, this is definitely it. So, there it is. And she's not on this one. What, what shrine am I thinking of? This girl is like, slapped over on, and you gotta go bring her her drink. Huh. Well, either way, we found, we found the fairies, so... Let's go on here. See, uh, see what we can do. Mm. Surviving the cold with your boy Guzma. Mm. Okay. This is, it looks like a block puzzle. Low battery, man. Trying to hold me down with some low battery, tripping. Okay, so you gotta like set this block in between in some certain type of way. And there's two blocks, so. Good enough for government work. No, I was not trying to do that. Whatever, you got the ball rolling. It, they figured it out. You'd be alright. And then you got some 
chesty chest in here. Oh, I, I see some some guardians up in this beast. It's all right, though. An ancient core, good deal. So, okay. I'm starting to see what's happening here. So, what's on the side? Lucky number five. Ah. I see. We got some housekeeping to do. Boom. And let's get that puppy close. Alright. Let's go kill some guardians real quick. Um, I'm just gonna switch my armor here because I'm not. I ain't trying to. You know. Get myself killed. And I do believe I need that chest, but I'm not sure. Right this second. But yeah, this could be tricky. So, the gimmick here is you don't want, you know. Man, you guys are jokes. Okay, guys. Not with the jokes. Yeah, and I see something over here. Yeah. You know what? I don't, I don't care. I'm just trying to do this shrine. There's... Okay, see, that's what it is. But what's this? Wait, Wait there's, there's more. Um... Uh, Okay. Tilting puzzle. And some sort of something behind here. Cog of some sort. Probably goes to this other thing. Okay, so I know what you want to do. Oh, so you do got to do that. So, okay. But I already know what to do. So it's all graving. And you know what? I might as well get that other thing here while I'm here. So... You just gotta carry this thing above your head, not to touch anything, so... Just be careful, because this platform will change and mess up your life if you hit one of these switches inadvertently. So, if you put that on there, it's gonna turn the cog for no reason, because you don't have it, because it's stuck behind them bars. And place good, good deal. So you want to come through here after putting that up, and then you want to get this chest because, you know, couple of goals, three hundred rupees, totally, totally worth it. It's weird because in every Zelda game, there's always like a ton of rupees in the desert for like no reason, or for some good reasons. I don't know. So. I do believe the other puzzle was this way. Yes, it was. And that shut down on me. Why are you shutting down on me? It senses the electricity. So it's trying to make it so you can't bring this thing over here. It's all good, though. I got you. So it's going to turn that, and I will be able to go by myself over here. Shouldn't I go all the way? I can't roll sand in this. Okay. So then make you solve this stupid puzzle. Whatever. So they line up all the way at the end, but for some reason, okay. So it's a game of blocks. No. Alright, there we go, right? That should do the trick. Survey says almost. So I got that first one to line up pretty good. And this one, but let's try. Now, it worked for like a half second, so you want to, okay, I see, you want to that, make, have that one move a little bit, 
so there's uh, so you gotta line them all up so they barely touch it okay boom let's do the spiel hmm okay I see what I see what you guys did there You gotta rough it. You gotta rough it a little bit. You'll be alright. Be alright. Okay. You gotta smooch it on over. Hmm. Difficult. Very. See, if you do that, it goes too far. Oh, okay. Oh, I see. Good. Ha! Ah. Boom. And... Let's just get... Bam. And thank you, ma'am. There we go. I saw what they were trying to do there. Quite simple. You just gotta know geometry. And a lovely sapphire. I like this, man. I wish finding this stuff in real life was so easy. Hey, or do a puzzle and uh, we give you free stuff. Like, you know, a very expensive sapphire for no reason. So you can by that gun you want it ever since you were a child. Alright, so you made it all the way. Killed a Maduga, did all this stuff, and boom. Yeah, the shrine. Yeah, yeah, I don't want to see this. Some old dude. Right, and I'm one step closer to killing Gan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. May the goddess smile upon you too, okay? I'm not Catholic, but I get it. A little pushy there. <laughs> Ooh, what time is it? Getting pretty late. I had to get up early, pay my car note. That was fun. <sighs> It's like paycheck? What paycheck? What? You get a paycheck? No, no, no. You don't get a paycheck. You pay your car. That, that's that's what happens. So now we've got a little warpy warp point all on over. There's millions and the Munduga. Boy. Boy. Sweet boy. Please listen to my son. Sure, how much, just, just tell me how much rupees you want, you greedy little great fairy lady. Place for a beautiful spring, past blah, 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 rupees. You know, it's for these people. Always with their money. Ten thousand dollars. That's right, folks. Ten thousand. Hand it over quickly or will nil you 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 think I got that type of money I, I respect but still I only got like eight hundo um yeah I'll keep my rupees lady yeah not that I had it over really nearly but the game taxes you they they smart they know what they're doing they're like you ain't getting here or will and nilly but this is the location of the fourth and final fair. And as you can see, I'm randomly collecting this stuff. So, obviously, I don't have enough money. But in my next video, I will definitely have the money. And to then, this has been your host, Brad the Gaming Chef. Stick